Hey y'all, it's your girl Empress Cheryl here to see what is going on, okay? What messages need to come out for you? What the spirit needs you to hear? What's going on in your energy, okay? We're just gonna kind of see what flows, what comes out. I'm gonna start with this um, African Goddesses Oracle deck just to get kind of like the main energy of the reading. And then I'll use these... Um, other decks to clarify okay so that's kind of like the main energy of this message okay we got three cards the first thing i got um initially actually was it's time for you to speak up it's time for you to speak up it's time for you to speak out. It's time for you to birth something. Like maybe you're going through some type of awakening. Maybe you're starting something. But um, this season's card, it talks about new cycles, talks about new things, talking about, you know what I'm saying, a new season, you being in a new season, like talks about new beginnings. Um, and then this speak up card. So maybe this is the time for you where um, your throat chakra is getting activated. Maybe it's a time for you that you're going to express yourself more maybe it's a time for you to be putting yourself um out more yeah definitely express oh okay so there's a lot of blue as well as a lot of purple in this card as well so this could be just you speaking out more in regards to um divine insight you know what i'm saying divine insight that you receive you actually deciding to speak on it you actually deciding to express yourself and i'm getting like you being um firm in it you being clear in it you being supported you being supported in it with all of these hands back here okay so it's like and and maybe it's a new season of um you may be from this car, I'm just looking at how, like, you may be um, covering yourself or you may have some type of veil over you or you may be seeing through the veil um, as well because this woman can clearly see, you know, through what's on um, her face. So it's just that may be the period that you're stepping into now as well where you're just easily able to see through the veil um and easily able to you know awaken awaken yourself awaken others you know what i'm saying able to step into this awakening but this is definitely like this is a spiritual period for you it's definitely what i'm getting here um a lot of uh, a spiritual period maybe like some a spiritual um births coming out but i'm getting like you are like you're kind of behind this or you're kind of like um a forefront um of this as well like you're you're birthing something this is your period of stepping into something your period of birthing something and your period of speaking out and actually being supported is what i'm getting as well okay so let's get some more cards to get more clarification or more messages for you more clarification for messages spirit what else do you want to add to this message you want to add to this message pay attention to the signs like if you feel like you're being um directed somewhere or you're being you know what i'm saying guided to a particular um direction like pay attention go in that way because this is if for this to be a period of heavy like spiritual enlightenment for you it's like i'm getting the sense that there will be signs everywhere you are respected more than you know this is your path to getting your justice this is your path to getting what it is that you truly deserve this is your journey to getting you know the your respect you know what i'm saying getting your flowers okay so Pay attention. You know what I'm saying? Pay attention to the signs. Seek out more quiet time. It may be time for you to like actually get to yourself. Get um connected with spirit. I'm just getting a, a sense of like, although you are supported, you are still like 
standing on your own. Like in, in this car here, this woman is all alone. In this car here, this woman is, you know what I'm saying? Like she has happiness and joy around her, but she's alone here birthing this thing. In this um car here, this woman is alone standing proud. However, she has forces behind her. She has support behind her, but she's still standing out and doing her thing, okay? So, you know, this is a period of... um. I'm just getting of you accepting uh, getting to yourself or accepting doing some things to yourself, but having support, you know what I'm saying? Or accepting being um, at the forefront or being a leader, okay? Uh, we have 444, love and wholeness, inner wisdom, guidance. Definitely trust. I'm just getting trust your soul, Trust your soul. Your soul is guiding you to where it is that you need to be, where 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 you're trying to go, what it is that you are um supposed to be doing. You know, like just your path. Your soul knows. <laughs> Trust the soul. Your soul knows. Okay. So I'm gonna get like one more of these and then we'll get something from the other deck. Spirit, what messages do you have? Smile, smile. Do not forget to smile. I'm just getting, it's your season. It's your season. Don't forget to smile. Like, it's a lot of things that's happening for you. It's a new season. Like, you know what I'm saying? Don't stress on some of the old things that were at, that were happening. Understand that now you're stepping into a new life. You're stepping into a new season. Like, you're, hey, you stepping out. This woman is popping out. She done popped out. You see this car? Like, that's you. And you speaking up. You're expressing yourself. Like, you're not holding back. And you are heavily supported. And you are getting your praises. You are getting your abundance. You are reaping your rewards. You know, here as well. So, smile. Understand that. You are being led. So, you need to pay attention to the signs. Because you are respected. But still make sure you <laughs> get some time to yourself as well, okay? So, what else? What final messages do you have, Spirit? What final messages do you have? What final messages do you have? We have 11th house, Aquarius, Uranus, teams, friendships, groups, society, technology, video and electronic media, networking, social justice, rebellion, and human and humanitarian causes. It also rules originality, eccentricity, sudden events, surprises, invention, astronomy, science fiction, and all things futuristic. Okay, so this is what I'm getting. Some of the thoughts that I got from this card was definitely online action online activity so maybe that's where you're sticking out at maybe that's where you're standing out at is doing things online putting things out online and then finding support that way you know what i'm saying so maybe that's why it's like you're alone because it's not necessarily like in a whole crowd as you going to a, a crowded place but you still having support because you have people that are coming to watch or people that are there you know to support you while you do your thing you know what i'm saying while you stand in your own energy so this could be a lot of online things um for you and then we have number 18 the moon cancer Moon, deep hidden emotion, feminine, subconscious, unknown fears, cycles, nighttime, the mother, secrets, psychic abilities, dreams, premonitions. Yes, you're speaking. I told you you're speaking out about some divine knowledge that you're receiving, some type of divine intelligence that you are getting. You are speaking out about it. This could be doing readings like this tarot reader this could be you know prophetic messages this could just be whatever type of downloads you get 
actually sharing like no longer holding it to your to yourself and actually sharing it and people understanding that people respecting that people knowing that it's coming from a greater source that knowing that it's coming from a greater you know what i'm saying a, a larger power than you that you are just the vessel is pretty much kind of what i'm getting here so it's your season it's your time to shine like don't shy away from it put yourself out there smile is coming in okay spirit is guiding you in this direction so go ahead and go with it all right y'all take care and have a jazzy day